How the hell y'all doing? Clip in the doorway too. Doing another one of those reviews you love oh so much. Today is Friday, January 8th, 2021. We are going to start off with a rather interesting review. I'm going to do a couple tonight, I think, just because that's what I feel like. This one is going to be by a project called uh, Nicarus. And the album is called Coal People, Coal Puppets. It was self-released today. Uh, and uh, it is uh, an I think it's a solo artist just under the name Nicarus. Her name is Tolly Green. And uh, looks like she put this all together in 2015 and has been worked with a bunch of other people uh, collaborating together on this record as well, too. It's six songs. I'd say it's a mix of indie rock, post rock, uh, some noisy rock elements, too. Uh, it's just a really, really strong record overall. She is based out of Israel. Um, and. Uh, Looks like her debut EP, Holy Son, Father, Spirit, came out last year. Uh, and this is the first full length. So again, Cold People, Cold Puppets, uh, Nicarus, and it came out today. It's self-released. Uh, I know they say it's a mix of uh, alt-rock, doom, grunge, and other elements like dark pop and stuff. But it's more of a uh, indie rock meets post-rock with uh, noise rock elements. Uh, there's some shoegazing moments as well, too, but uh, let's listen to the first song uh, out of the six. It's called Can We See Their Lies? We can, we can see their lies. to Chelsea Wolf and uh, what is it Emma Ruth Riddell and things along those lines because it does have that dark gothic pop element uh, to all that shoegaze and post rock elements as well too uh, but that's just one tip of the iceberg uh, like I said this record kind of goes in all different directions there's not just one direction that it goes in uh, Tally Green's voice is just really really interesting uh, so let's listen to another one of those six tracks. Uh, it's going to be track number two, and it's called Are You Afraid to Die Alone? <laughs> Thank you. 
Sticking through tired bones Right between the veins To twist our mind and feed us with dusty Hollowed and poison grains It picks the darkest night Changing positions from left to right We carry our hearts for ages And in the fridge to fight more of a heavy indie rock kind of vibe kind of breeders belly veruca salt kind of elements with some noisy rock elements as well too uh so it kind of does the whole scope and gamut uh but tolly's vocals are just stunningly beautiful and epic on this song and uh it just sounds really 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 impressive and well done full and heavy and almost goes in that kind of metallic shoegazing kind of vibe but it never quite reaches that point uh, I don't know. Uh, if you like bands like Catherine Wheel and stuff like that, it kind of has that element at times too. Uh, let's listen to another track. Uh, this is going to be track number four and it's called Architect of Grime. <laughs> Thank you. 
So that one's kind of got more of a gritty kind of punk meets noise rock meets kind of uh, just, I don't know, grungy kind of vibe to it. I'd say uh, if you like stuff like L7 and Babes in Toyland, there's a lot of elements there. And almost that uh, Julie Christmas uh, made out of babies kind of when she's not screeching really violently, those kind of vibes. Uh, I love when uh, Julie Christmas does all those crazy heavy vocals too. But when she really tries to sing, that's kind of the vibe I'm getting from this as well. Um, Like I said, Nicarus, pretty goddamn awesome, out of Israel. Uh, really impressive of uh, Cole People, Cole Puppets. It was self-released today again. Six songs, well over 40 minutes of just wonderful, wonderful recordings. Uh, let's listen to the very last track, track six, and then we'll kind of wrap this up. It's called The Stuff You Pack When You're a Time Traveler. We know it will be a good flight. Good luck and Godspeed. 40 seconds away from the Apollo 11. Like I said, that's more of that indie kind of dark pop, uh, shoegazing, post-rock kind of vibe again. It just mixes it all together. Uh, Nicarus, uh, really, really love your record. Uh, Tali, you have a great voice. Uh, Everything and everybody that did all the music around it, I think you guys did a great, great, great kind of element. Uh, definitely layers a lot of the 90s kind of Indian heavy rock and noise rock elements and then mixes a lot of that shoegazing and post-rock as well too. Again, record came out today, self-released. I will put links down to where you can purchase it digitally and all the other formats that you might be able to get it in. Uh, if you like what you're hearing, uh, you like what I'm um, doing, Definitely like and subscribe the uh, YouTube and Facebook pages for The Doorway 2. Again, Clint from The Doorway 2. Uh, thanks again, and uh, see ya.